Today is the first day of space camp for some children in Manchester, Vermont. It will blend art, science, and of course, imagination. Local 22's Dana Casulo is live in the studio with more on this out of this world adventure. Lauren, Space Camp is run through a collaboration between the Southern Vermont Art Center and the Manchester Rec Center. Space Camp in Southern Vermont will keep kids between 5 and 12 busy for two weeks. On day one, children learned how to make sundials. Which are a really ancient technology, but a way that we can um, tell time using the sun without having a clock in front of us. And one of the things that makes a sundial work is understanding uh, your latitude. So understanding where you are on planet Earth. Andrea Michael Bust is a space camp instructor and has had a passion for space her entire life. I am an artist by trade, but um, loved space when I was a little kid, dreamed of being an astronaut. Even though she dreamed of being an astronaut, now the kids at camp might have a shot. And that's something that the kids are really going to be doing over at the rec center where there is a swimming pool. And just like real astronauts do, kids can practice um, how you would work and live in zero gravity in a swimming pool. The 35 children will learn about neighboring planets and distant galaxies. They will also create space shelters and go on space scavenger hunts. They're eager to kind of jump in and both think about some of the serious things, you know, like how far planets are away from the sun, but also to imagine what um, a person from another planet might look like. Michael Bus believes space is a great topic to engage children in their imagination. Because we can talk about planets that we'll never be able to see with our own eyes and imagine the universe that's just so vast. During the second week of camp, children will build rockets. Reporting live in the studio, Dana Casulo, Local 22 News.